Check it out, check it out, check it out, check it out. I got two sets of the 2014 Walmart exclusive Easter exclusives, plus a few extra ones. I also got the Target Easter five, or four packs, I guess they are this year. You know, the, the Target ones uh, are no longer the exclusive cars, they're just basic line cars. I don't know, there might be some variations in there, some wheel variations or something, but they're basically just basic line cars and Easter packaging. So, uh, unless you're collecting the packaging, there's uh, no reason to get them. Then again, the Easter exclusives are totally cool. And once again, I've got them all. Two sets of them all. Let's take a closer look. Okay, here's the back side of one of the Easter exclusives. Shows all eight cars. Let's take a closer look at them. Starting with this Camaro. 69 Camaro in green. Black, white, and yellow tampo on it. Basic wheels with yellow rims. Nice color on top. Racing stripes on it. Looks good. It's a Camaro. One of my favorites. Personally, I think this is the best of the eight. I really like this one. Let's look at the next one. 70 Chevelle Convertible. This is a really nice casting. It's got basic wheels. This has been out a lot. I think this was uh, started for uh, uh, the online club. It's a nice casting. Very good. Top and bottom. I don't really like that orange interior, but for an Easter exclusive, a holiday car, the color scheme works. I like this one. This one will be a valuable car in the future. Next is the 32 Ford Vicky. I always buy this casting whenever it comes out because it's one that I had in my childhood. In fact, I think I had three of them. Well, I still do have them, but anyways, it's one of my favorite cars. This one is in turquoise with a orange, uh, purple, and white color scheme. Nice colors for Easter. Those yellow wheels don't really match the rest of it, but uh, for an Easter, it makes the contrast appropriate for an Easter item and a bright colored item for a young child, too. So this makes this a good, a very good, memorable Easter toy, and it's one of the original Hot Wheels, one of the original 16s, the 32 Ford Vicky. So this is a special one for me, and uh, I like it. It's a good Hot Wheel. Next is the boom box. An SUV blinged out with bling wheels, graffiti all over it. It's red with green windows. Green wheels. That's unusual. This is a rare Easter exclusive casting. Boombox, not one of my favorites, but not a bad casting. And this is uh, quite an unusually decked out one. Being that it's a Walmart exclusive Easter exclusive, this will be one of the rare variations of this casting. Gotta like it. Next is the Metro Rail. The Nash Metro Rail. This casting you don't see a lot of, but it comes out semi-regularly in uh, uh, exclusives. Those that like it really like it. It's a drag rail exclusive vehicle. Look at that. It's got purple wheels, too. That's got to be unusual. This is a nice casting. A nice color contrast. I really like this one. This is one of the better of the Easter exclusives this year. The Metro Rail, Nash Metropolitan. I like it. Next is the Phaeton. 
This has been a very popular casting since it came out. Personally, I don't like it that much, but uh, everyone else does. Here it is in orange with a white rag top. Black wheels. Nice car. Nice colors. It's uh, an Easter egg inclusive. I like it. Here's a Pontiac. I gotta love Pontiacs because I was born in Pontiac. The cars in the city were both named after the same Indian. Anyways, this is a pro stock Pontiac Firebird. A race car. Pimped out car now, something you see on the street. And white wheels too. Now that that's the first white wheels I've ever seen. There's a lot of new inclusives in these Easter egg inclusives this year. Including these white wheels. I like this Pontiac. I really like this one. In fact, I even bought an extra one to keep. Hey, it's a great car. And last but not least, Toyota off-road truck in yellow with purple wheels, green trim. That's uh, well, it's a bright, festive color scheme. It works for Easter inclusives. It's uh, kind of ugly, though. I mean, it's the kind of thing that would be appealing to a uh, Young child, bright colors attract their attention. This is a rare variation of this truck too, and uh, well, you see what it looks like, you judge for yourself. Anyways, happy Easter and happy hot wheeling to everyone out there. Enjoy! I'm going to open these two cars on Easter Sunday and race them and see what happens.